I'm not one of those guys that typically just hangs up posters of, and like wears shirts of bands that they know absolutely fucking nothing about. But that Doors poster is the one exception to that. Hey everybody, welcome back. Happy Friday. It is Dylan or Jigsaw. Today we are here with more of The Doors. Now we haven't touched on The Doors in a long time. I think we hit, uh, fuck. I've only touched on two songs, Riding on the Storm and, shit, why can I not remember the names of these songs? I just looked at them. We've only touched on two songs, that being Riders on the Storm and Light My Fire. And today we are here with one that I feel is a little bit known to me. The title itself just kind of seems familiar, but I've never really listened to The Doors on my own. May have heard it through a movie, may have heard it through a TV show, who knows. I think it's been literally maybe almost a year since I've listened to The Doors because it was probably around the time I first started the channel. Started to spread out to some more artists, and then other artists ended up just kind of blowing up when I was reacted to them, so I kind of got distracted. Forgot about some of the other ones, and I apologize for that. But without further ado, let's get on Break On Through by The Doors. Oh, okay. You know the day destroys the night. Night divides the day. Try to run, try to hide. Break on through to the other side. Okay. Chased our pleasures here, dug our treasures there. But can't you still recall the time we cried? Break on through to, to the, the other, other side. side. I remember that part, but like, that's about it. <laughs> Woo! We never get fucking piano on here, or the keyboard, whatever you want to call it. Electric keyboard, my bad. just gonna end it like that like i said i do feel that i've heard that song before whether it be from a movie from my parents or something but i've never personally sat down listened to the song listened to the lyrics all i know about that song up until this point was break on through to the other side that's it they did something that i was not expecting that i've never really heard much in the songs that we've been listening to and that was the electric keyboard that just sounded so good. Like, whoever was on the keys, bro. <laughs> Woo! We need to touch more on the doors, and I understand that. I have only done two songs, this one being the third. So, we got way more to come. But I also want to touch on the Cranberries, because my mom has been recommending me to listen to the Cranberries for so long, and I have yet to do it, and we need to touch on that. And I know there's going to be at least one comment in there saying, how have you never listened to The Doors, but you have a poster for The Doors right up there? Right up there! Uh, it was my dad's. Um, he just kind of gave me a bunch of his stuff. Pink Floyd is a whole other story. I love the fuck out of Pink Floyd. Listen to them religiously. But The Doors is one that I've just never really touched upon. So call me a poser. I don't care. 
I'm not one of those guys that typically just hangs up posters of, and like wears shirts of bands that they know absolutely fucking nothing about. But that Doors poster is the one exception to that. My first actual like explosion experience to the Doors, believe it or not, was from Skrillex. <laughs> he did a song with the Doors called Breaking a Sweat, and it was just yeah, I, I, that was just an intense song. It, I, that song was something that I feel like I could use to just get hyped up, to just kind of like get in a good mood, to get like let's let's go, let's let's go. I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here. Like I said, if you do enjoy the videos, make sure to leave a like down below, hit that subscribe button, and turn on your post notifications because I do upload every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Next week we will be starting a show called The Boys. You guys voted the fuck out of that show when I put it on the polls for what we're gonna react to next and. That just absolutely blew everything else out of the water. So starting next Friday, March 17th, we will be li <sighs> will not be listening to the boys. We will be watching the boys. The first episode of the first season. Dear God, I can't talk. So I'm going to try and end the video here if I can't stutter anymore throughout the rest of this sentence. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like down below. Hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Adios.